Just get the, uh, what is it, possible spam notification. Yes, love that. Yep, just delete, nope. <laughs> decline. Nope, nope. Uh, but you're not going to be saying nope until you see the forecast for the second half of the week. Yes, okay. <laughs> First part of the week, love. I mean, 60s. We could be almost at 70 degrees on Tuesday. So there's some warm stuff early on. And then we have a full-on switch to windy and wet and 30s. Like, not kind of the worst. Yes, like a cold rain, some wet snowflakes. Let's break all of that down, shall we? Yes. Let's take a look at what to expect as we go through the next couple of days. For today, clouds slowly return as we go through the day. Our temperatures hit the low 60s. All in all, Today is pretty great for mid November. Early in the week, that mild feel sticks around. We're going to be in the 60s the next several days. Spotty rain chances out there, meaning maybe a sprinkle tomorrow. And we do start the day Tuesday with rain showers, but it's late in the week that everything turns for us. A major cold front comes through Wednesday and Thursday, and really Thursday is the main day of impact from this thing. Expect falling temperatures, gusty winds, and the potential for kind of a rain snow mix. It's a lot of rain, some wet snowflakes, but 35 degrees, cold rain, wet snow. Ugh. Not feeling great, right? With that, as we go late in the week, we'll get there. But today we're starting out with clear skies. 41 degrees right now. Winds out of the south southeast, eight miles an hour. It's that southerly component that's going to help drive our temperatures today up into the 60s. So plan on a chilly start early with those clearer skies. Grab a winter coat and some sunglasses when you head out the door. Uh, by noon, we should be in the upper 50s. And then into the afternoon, clouds will start to move in. So it's kind of the reverse of yesterday. Yesterday we had the clouds and then they cleared out just in time to make it cold. Well, today we'll have some sunshine. Clouds roll in just in time to keep us comfortable into the evening. So 7 o'clock, we're at 54 degrees. And when you're watching the game tonight, right here on WLWT, that kickoff right around 820, 54 degrees, not bad. So 8 o'clock at night with a temperature above our average high. And post game, temperature doesn't drop much because of those clouds in place. So decent weather for your plans to watch the game tonight. We're looking at the radar this morning. Everything is looking pretty quiet for us. Uh, that first taste of winter comes in later this week, and here's how it plays out. It looks like on Wednesday, uh, the rain chances seem to be a little bit lower at this point. Uh, latest models kind of bringing in just some spotty showers, but breezy conditions as the temperatures start to slide on Wednesday. As we go in Wednesday night into Thursday morning, we've got rain kind of transitioning to a bit of a Rain snow mix through the day Thursday temperatures do stay above freezing, so the roads are going to be fine. But anytime you have that falling during a commute, it could have some impact both in the morning and potentially even the evening commute on Thursday. It's going to be cold and wet and in the 30s, and that's no one's favorite. As we take a look, this is just kind of a general outlook at Thursday. A rain and then a transition there to maybe a rain snow mix, so wet snowflakes and rain through the day gusty winds to like 30 miles an hour. So this is what you're looking at Thursday. The road stage is wet, but just kind of a nasty feel for Thursday, right? Friday rain showers and we should be back, up, you know, back up to about 40 or so on Friday. OK, so for today, 62 degrees. We start out with nice sunny skies. We slowly bring in the clouds on Monday, 62 degrees. Taking a closer look at your Monday forecast. 8 a.m. We should be about 51 by noon. We're at 61 and we hang out in the low 60s for Monday. Tuesday, the rain is around only first thing in the morning, so a wet morning rush and then much warmer in the afternoon. And then we'll keep an eye on the developing system for Wednesday and Thursday that right now brings falling temperatures and kind of a rain snow mix for us on Thursday. All right, Randy, thank you. Well, still ahead, Thanksgiving.